City, Arizona, and today I'm bringing you lesson number 25 in my slow and easy accordion class, and it's a couple of whistle songs. So we've got I Whistle a Happy Tune from The King and I in 1956, and Whistle While You Work, that's from Snow White and the Seven Dwarfs, and that's even older, that's from 1937. And for this tune, um, we have got, first of all, I'm playing on the Roland FR-8X. Uh, so for this tune, I have used a flute sound. For some parts of it, and I've used a dry accordion sound. For other parts of it, if you are playing on an acoustic accordion, you might want to switch between, say, a bandonian sound and a violin sound or a celeste or one of those, uh, whatever you've got available on your instrument to make a difference in the sounds. So just going through this tune, uh, first of all, you need to go to mycrownmusic.net to get the free sheet music for this song. It is Lesson 25, and you will find it listed up there. It's been there for a while, and I've finally gotten around to doing the video for this lesson. Did you hear the ding in the room? That was my boss at the music store calling to tell me that another customer ordered an instrument. So I got to go in in a little bit, but anyhow, I want to finish uh, doing what we talked about here today. So I've used a couple of different sounds, the whistle sound and the uh, um, accordion bandonian sound, and some things to watch out for in this song. Um, first of all, you'll see that the song is in the key of G, so that means you've got an F sharp. And as you're going along, it's just uh, plain old alternating in your left hand, nothing new or fancy there. Um, but then when you get to measure, it looks like 21 here, and you got to watch out for a C minor chord, and you've got a E flat in your right hand, so it's... Oh, and by the way, I um, depending upon what registration you use, I wrote this music in the, within the staff, but I'm playing it up an octave, and it's just for the sound, and it's up to you. Um, if you've got an eight-foot sound on, like the violin or celeste sound or whatever on your accordion, um, it will sound good in this lower area, but if you've got a 16-foot register like a bassoon or a bandonian, um, you'll need to play it up so it doesn't sound so growly. Anyhow, so we've got that C minor chord, and then to the G chord, and then to an A chord, and there's a A sharp in there. That's a little tricky. So anyhow, that goes along until measure 35, 36, or 7, 38, and then you'll see a double bar and I changed keys. And so what you're gonna to wanna to do when you're at measure 35, 36, 37, and 38 is at measure 38, maybe cut that a little short so that you can make, have time to make your registration change. So we'll be going. And then the next thing you gotta get in your head is the key change. Don't go, the, the second note in Whistle While You Work is an F. Don't go and play it sharp. Um, several times when I was just getting this video ready to go, I played that note sharp, and I had to stop and, and correct myself, so it's... And now I change keys again, and I went to the key of F, and uh, there you've got to watch out for the B flat. And then here, this is, could be a little tricky, it's... And then you, everything up a half step. And if you're gonna play the bass note, it's the F sharp counter bass, which is in front of D. And then G. And then make your registration change again, and now you got to go back to measure 11 on the other page. And you can play around with this 
you know, that however you make it sound good is fine. It's totally up to you. So again, uh, if you're enjoying these lessons, please hit the like and he, please subscribe to my channel. And if you know somebody who's interested in accordion, um, or if you don't even know somebody who's interested in accordion, just have people on, on your friends list, send a, one of the lessons to them. Maybe, maybe you can tell them something new that they don't know about you. Say, I'm learning how to play the accordion. Anyhow, thanks for watching.